Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, this is the daily video update for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. My name is the Reverend Oscar Sinclair. Today is April 29th, 2020. It is Wednesday. Uh, and uh, <laughs> um, time is strange enough right now that I had to check what day of the week it was. One of the remarkable parts of this is how much we are able to do via technology. Even uh, if this pandemic had happened half a generation ago, um, we weren't, we wouldn't be able to handle it in the same way. I wouldn't be able to do these videos every day. We're liberated in a way by our capacity to see and hear each other, despite not being in the same rooms. But it is a very different way of being together. I'm a millennial. I was born in the 80s and was in high school at the turn of the millennium. But I might actually be a, a bad millennial because even though there's a, a computer with a Spotify account sitting in my office, able to play just about any song I can come up with in, in moments, I still love the turntable that's also in my office. This is despite the, sp the stereotype true of many folks of my generation. We might be digital natives more or less, but that makes us value the tangible felt world all the more. And so uh, for myself, I went into the most analog job you can, you can go into, the work of ministry. And the work of my ministry, I would have said three months ago, depends on connecting thought and feeling, making sure that we aren't just up here, but that we're also dealing with what is tangible. It's a task of religion to join these two truths that we are, uh, as Yoda says, luminous beings. And we are also this, this stuff, this matter. I am both my soul and my body. And so we build ritual in our faith by joining those two things, by building a cairn on Sunday morning, pouring water, bringing together flowers. It's different now, and one of the pieces of complexity that I'm holding on to these days is how to do that work when the actual tool that we have is pixels on a screen. It can be done. We know it can be done. The Way of the River, the Church of the Larger Fellowship, us in the last couple months, we've, we've shown that it is possible. But it does require some rethinking of how we connect with each other and ourselves. Lots to think about today. Have a great afternoon, and I will see you tomorrow.